<laughs> Can you rename your illuvials? Uh, no, I don't believe so. No. Just like like in Pokemon, you can like nickname them, right, or something like what, like this. What are you gonna rename them? Ah, uh, like Timmy? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs>when you cast them you have like 50 of like 50 of atlases right and like one yeah. of them gonna be like the perfect one right like the hondo or <laughs> the first one yeah oh yeah like the so you you have to know like how to recognize them and stuff right so it would be nice to just have a way to to give them a nickname or something yeah to, yeah to track them so i guess yeah they i mean they're nfts so they'll have a token id like i don't know if you'll be able to see it in game oh have so fun with that idea. yeah i would have like i would have to have like a piece of paper on my desk with yeah, like, yeah right this number <laughs> is is like yeah this is to yeah. sell this is to <laughs> yeah to keep yeah <laughs> All right, all right. I'll, I'll talk to. It's a good point. I'll bring it up. Oh, I, I bet they like they already thought about this, right? It's uh, maybe. I mean, if it's just a UI thing, I don't see why it would be an issue. Yeah, it's, uh, it's you can just attach the ID to some like value in like yeah, which gonna be like the nickname or something. Give so. me that links. What the hell? That happened. There we go. Oh, yeah. What do you guys think is like the strongest alluvial? <clears throat> um, I don't know. I feel like uh, Axodon's pretty uh pretty beefy. Eh. But I think it just depends. Mm -hmm. Who's your strongest, Dzerski? Um, like surprisingly, T zeros are so strong, like Groco, Fleeces, right? That uh, Lynxes, all of them are like very strong. It's not like yeah, oh, I have T zero, like whatever. Okay, let's see. I'm sure my inventory is getting full. What happens when it gets full? I don't know. I don't want to find out, though. Um, You'll probably just have to morph and then to make room, right? Yeah, yeah, that's what I mean. I'm gonna have. I'm just gonna go back anyways. I'm just saying, like, if it's full and you're trying to capture an alluvial, if they just uh, oh, that would suck. If you're like you're not yeah, paying if you attention, lose it, and then you get it full, and you're like, oh my god, I needed that one. Fuck. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if that happens or not. Sorry. I guess there's only one way to find out. I guess I could just. I confuse. There's so many like loading screens. It would be nice to just like you're done with with your run, and just click click one button and you're going back to Sanctum. To like to the place where you are right now, because it's gonna be like yeah. the main spot. Like a home button? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Will you ever, do you think we'll ever be able to morph like different ones together instead of having to have three of the same? Uh, I don't think it's planned. I think they, yeah, that would be a whole nother beast. That'd be new art and everything. <laughs> yeah, I, I, they, they haven't talked about it at least, but I mean, shoot, everything's always an option, right? Correct. And you had, you have like 20 plus shards, right? You, you crafted them by yourself? All of them? No, I cheated. Cheated. Okay. Yeah. I, I was like, that. I was wondering how, how long it would took you to have this like 
plus no i couldn't even figure out how to make one and so i asked, <laughs> I asked andre if i could uh because they have like for the qa you know qa has to have shards and stuff uh, yeah, so. yeah, for, yeah for sure yeah so yeah i just type in a little code and then bam it drops me 30 shards is that a lot yeah i mean yeah. i imagine like I was running around for a while, like trying to like get all this stuff to craft a shard by myself, and like I ran around a bit, and I still couldn't craft one. So, but yeah, but maybe like I said, they yeah they're probably all of this is like like they up the encounters, they up the harvestables, you know, depending on how long. That's why QA is testing now, and we're gonna have everyone test like how long it takes to like make something, you know, like what. Yeah. Like, yeah, because that all goes into the economy of it too, you know. Is it real? Is it realistic? <laughs> but what what you were collecting for for shards? I you have to go for the rocks, right? Not for the plants. Yeah, yeah. There's rocks, but I never got like the stuff. Yeah, yeah. Out of the out of the rock. Why? I don't know. Unlucky? I think I think maybe <laughs> I was... Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, unlucky, I guess. Like, I got stuff out of the rock. It just wasn't... And I had, like, most... I'll show you guys once I get back over there. Yep. The materials yeah, that I need. Yeah, but out of the rocks is where you get shards, isn't it? But he but has it's, to like, material them. for a shard. Yeah. Here, I'll find a shard rock. Maybe Hold it's on. a glitch. Uh, yeah, I mean, it might not be added in fully. Yet. I think, yeah, I don't know. Oh, like I said, I think it was a, I think it was more of a me problem than a game problem. Yeah. You didn't know how to play it. <laughs> yeah. But it's good because then we can have guides for this type of shit. You know, somebody's gonna come up with a bad, badass guide with everything, like wh what rocks you're gonna get, where to cure them. On the list for Timmy. Oh, see, so this isn't the ones, the other one's a shard deposit. It says actual shard deposit or something like that. Got it. Oh, so, but the first one you clicked, you you only scanned them. Yeah. And, no, and now when the background turning blue, you, you, you're picking those ones, right? Yeah. But there's some, like, so you can extract, you can actually just extract without um, scanning as well. I don't know the benefit of it, really. Like, it seems like you don't need to scan. Like, maybe that comes into your inventory being full. Like, if you even want to waste the resources, you know, to yeah. um, if you actually need... gather this stuff. Yeah, if you need something specific, right, and it's not there, you don't want to waste yeah. the... Yeah, uh, your energy and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, or if like yeah, you're running low on energy and you're like shit. I just wanted to see. Yeah. Could you go for like one or two more rocks so we can like try to make one? Yeah. Shot? I'm like very interested. How how much like you need? To, yeah. Like... Well, let me see. Um, here, let me do this one more encounter yeah, 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 real yeah. quick. Actually, here. Hold on. What was that? And so I can teleport back here. Because there's like three encounters right here. That's crazy. I, I, I saw this first time. Like, did you have to like use energy to, to make this like checkpoint or whatever? Uh, I don't think you ha you do. I don't think so. Huh. They, he said you can make three of them, though. That's it. Yeah. Still nice. Like, <laughs> and I assume like when you want to make a fourth one, the the first one is overrated, or it's just uh, yeah, like the I limit guess. that you just. I don't know, I haven't tried yet, I guess. I can try real quick.
It worked exactly like I planned. <laughs> Let's go, Archie. Oh, I'll take it. But see, so like I'm in like the stage one or the tier one, whatever the stage one, um, like version of this, right? Or tier one. So, like, there's tier zero that I started in with, like, the Grokos and stuff. Yeah. So, uh, so, like, I have two of each of those Grokos. So, like, I almost want to go back to the tier zero so I can upgrade those Grokos. Yeah. Know? And, they're like, yeah. But at the same time, it's like people are going to be trying to jump ahead to catch, you know, the higher tier shit, too. Yeah, but I think like you don't wanna skip T zeros. They are like too strong. They they gonna give you so much power, like the uh, yeah for like future to, to win more stages. around. Yeah, yeah. They just too powerful to to skip. Okay, so let's find it. Oh, look at there's rock. Anomalous or anomalous or it just feels like this game's gonna be super time consuming, right? Yeah, yeah, but time consuming in a good way. <laughs> yep. At least you're uh, you're gonna be catching something that's worth money to somebody. Catching my love, baby. So we can sell them if we mint them, right? Or something. I mean, once once you start catching them, there's going to be a market for them for sure. Yeah. Like they'll be up on the Aluvadex immediately, I'm sure. And and that's when we sell them, because I'm, I'm yeah, not super yeah. competent on that. Yeah, so they're all going to be on layer two on IMX. Mm -hmm. So like, our marketplace runs on IMX. If you haven't connected to it yet, like, you could go check it out and create an IMX wallet. We have a guide, I think, linked in the Discord somewhere, but um, I could find it for you. Just, I'm right in the middle of this. But, um, no, yeah, either way, either way, uh, yeah, you create an IMX wallet, it's all on layer two. So then when uh, you catch this alluvial, it essentially mints it to your wallet and, you know, you own it at that point, and then you would. If you wanted to, you could take it and you could put it on the marketplace and try and sell it. Okay. And when you say the marketplace, you mean like on IMAX or on another like platform? Because it's on the our same platform. thing as MetaMask, right? Yeah, it, it hooks up to MetaMask on our platform. Like, mm -hmm. um, yeah, you, on Alluvium.io, you'll see the Alluvidex on there. And uh, yeah, you can go in there and you'll connect up to that and that's right now the only thing on there is like land essentially because that's the only sale we've had okay so I, it looks like I do have this stuff and I must have got one. it cured common shard okay so and you have only yeah, one so, of these rocks yeah yeah so like, like exactly like I don't even know when I got it but I was probably just running around and snag didn't notice you know interesting so when you get um when you get these pieces, you just press forge and then it creates shard. Yep, and then you get a shard. 
So these are the best ones. And Why looks are like the best it, ones? it doesn't cost you anything to cure them, right? You just have to go back and cure them. Yeah, at least currently. Yeah. yeah. Wait, so you basically have to do a two-step process to forge, is what I'm seeing, then? <clears throat> you, by getting the resources, you mean, and then forging it? So everything's just press forge, basically. Yeah, this is to make the shards, yeah. Oh, did you took the... Uh... Oh, I didn't. Yeah. I did not. I did not. And I forgot to do my kukulos too. Yeah. There, there is like every stream I, I watch, people never take them. That It would be nice <laughs> to just like some mechanic that yeah. helps. Yeah, me. Aaron said that we had to do it that way because of the fact that, you know, they're NFTs. Yeah, yeah how they are. Uh... Okay. Oh wait, I think I got something else too. Uh, oh, and oh, you had some armor. Yeah, and I got some drone slots. Oh wait, I need to actually equip them. That's the that's the thing. Huh. Okay, now I'm getting the hang of it. All and right, now I got. Science to here. Could you just show me one like the the uh, the cheapest uh, weapon? How much like stuff yeah. requires? Yeah, let's go look. Because I haven't created a weapon yet. Uh, let's see. And and um, you have a filter, Seems right? To... If you could just like click on like zero or one on the left. Oh, okay, no tier one. Okay. The hybrid oh. looks cheapest. Uh, yeah. the, but, but that's the armor, right? Uh, see, I want this, is yeah. what I want. Oh, so that, that's a lot of. Is that say eight? Stuff. Does that say eight of them? Yeah. Eight what? Yeah, eight of these. Oh. Two of those. Yeah, see, that's yeah. quite a bit. So the, the yeah. one... Sixteen of... yep. or twelve? So the one on the right, you have to, like, this forge. One. Like, uh, and the one, like, before. Rare. Yeah. Yeah, but, and but, I, that's but, what I was asking Andre about. Like, I don't know. He said you had to, like, deconstruct something in order to do it. But like, I, had never had, I never had anything to deconstruct. Oh, well, there like, you go. Go back to that. Oh, wait, what is it? The deconstruct section? Right there where it says deconstruct? Yeah, the, the but... Right? Yeah, I'm looking at what it... Uh, see, it gives what me... What happens oh, when you deconstruct? Can't you put it back together? No, because it's going to give me this. It's not going to give yeah. me my resources. Ew, gross. So maybe if I deconstruct this, what do I get? Ah. Uh, okay. I get it. Huh. Okay. 